This popular beach along Australia's southwest coast is closed after a shark nicknamed Brutus killed a surfer Saturday. Witnesses say the great white bit 24-year-old Benjamin Charles Linden in half. It is just a tragic loss. It'll never stop surfers going in the water. Once you are a surfer, uh, and only a surfer knows the feeling, we cannot stop surfing. We are addicted. Surfers gave the shark the nickname after seeing it over the previous four days in the waters not far from Wedge Island. They say it's a massive animal that may be 16 feet long. Linden was the fifth surfer killed off the southwest coast in less than a year. Yeah, huge surprise. Um, I don't think really anyone expects the shark attack at, at Wedge Island. It's sort of our, I suppose, people who come to Wedge, it's, this is their safe place, I suppose, where they get away from all the, all the action in the city. Officials had been looking for Brutus, but had been scaling back their search by late Saturday night. But those who love to surf will be back in the water as soon as they can. A lot of fine weather, I think, super clear water and probably more people in the water. No more surfing by ourselves up here, I think. Yeah, a solo surf's probably a finish now, thing of the past for me anyway. But they know Brutus, or another equally dangerous shark, could be circling. Matt Friedman, Associated Press.